When the patient comes to our office for an ambulatory EEG, it takes about 30 minutes to apply the electrodes to the head, wrap the head so that the electrodes stay in place, and put all of the equipment that they need into a backpack that they wear. They then go home and they will stay at home for anywhere from 24 to 48 hours. During that time, we encourage the family to have the child participate in all their usual homebound activities. They don't shower, obviously, but everything else we try to keep as normal as possible because we're trying to make the environment as conducive to being able to capture that spell as we possibly can. When the 24 or 48 hour time period is over, they come back to our office, we disassemble the equipment, and then we download the information into our computer system, after which the doctor reads the study. Part of the equipment that the family takes home is an actual small video camera. It's about the size of a palm, and we encourage the families to keep it on throughout most of the period of time that the child is home. This way we're capturing what looks to be normal behavior as well as any behavior that the family may feel is abnormal. We will often ask the family to record times and dates in which they feel that the spell occurred. We have a backup system because there is a push button device on the equipment that can mark the point in the EEG when the family felt that behavior was abnormal so that we can correlate the behavior with the EEG in a time-synchronized fashion.